Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on your location. Please join in the struggle to liberate our people from the contraption. Like and share videos now the update for this Friday. Lawmaker writes Stinibu requesting additional state for the southeast. Now, a lawmaker in the Indianambra State House of Assembly representing Newinot constituency, Honorable Augustine Onyakachuku, has written to President Bola Tinibu. Yes, he is demanding for additional state for the people of the Southeast Zone. He said that Bola Tinibu should treat his letter not just as a want but as a need because the Southeast Zone has been marginalized. The lawmaker has brought to the fore again the prolonged marginalization, marginalization of the Southeast Zone. He said, to create this state will be in the interest of Nigeria, not for the east, for the southeast. Yes, he said, the name of the state should be Ikemba State, and the capital located in Newe, Newe not to be precise, Newe not. And he said, it will serve as an economic hub for Nigeria. The lawmaker stated that, look, as the southeast has only Eight, 15 senators, they're supposed to have 18 because, according to him, other regions have 6-6 six, six geopolitical at least. It's only the sad is that has 5 among the six geopolitical zones. Other ones have at least 6. Why the sad is 5? Only for sad is. So the, long, the lawmaker is demanding additional state. Let me read his letter. I read, Happy Idal Adha celebration, Mr. President. The Idal Adha is known as the Feast of Sacrifice. Idal Adha commemorates the Quranic tale of Prophet Abraham's willingness to sacrifice his son Ishmael as an act of obedience to God. Thus, no better time to bring up this request before you and the leadership of the 10th National Assembly. Mr. President, the arguments for the six states to be created in the Southeast Geopolitical Zone are not only compelling but are grounded in history. In the very essence of democracy is the need to strike a balance if Nigeria is founded on six geopolitical zones and each of five geopolitical zones has six states. It is then equitable that every geopolitical zone must have six states. Thus, Nigeria cannot, on grounds of good logic, be said to have six geopolitical zones until Mr. President assents to the proposal to create the six states in the Southeast in the spirit of equity and fairness. The Southeast is a very historical region in Nigeria, and the memories of the good days in Nigeria is rooted to Ojuku family. Lord Louis Philip Odumegu Ojuku hosted the Queen of England, and his son embraced the military and was of great service both to his region and Nigerians in general. Thus, naming such state Ikamba State with its headquarters in Newe will tranquilize all agitations in the southeast. The Ikamba State will serve as another economic hub in Nigeria and the Apollo state towards a new Nigeria. Thus, the need for the capital to be in Newe not Aligia is beyond historical reason. Mr. President, reminding you that the Southeast Geopolitical Zone is supposed to have a total of 18 senators, not 15, as the case is at present, is analogous to telling one the need to eat balanced diet. It cannot be overemphasized. The only way to fill this vacuum is to prioritize the creation of the remaining state for the Southeast Zone within one year. The sixth state is already a manufacturing and trading hub. In the Southeast will provide Nigeria with alternative revenue to oil and maybe the China in Nigeria if properly created. Mr. President, I need not remind you that prioritizing this proposal will make you the greatest president in the history of Nigeria and posterity will not forget you. Whilst we continue to remember your administration in our prayers, 
kindly treat this proposal as a need, not a want. End of quote. I've stopped reading. And this is what the the young member representing Newinot is asking from Tinibu to do. And what are we not saying? We are saying, look, he's a young, vibrant man. So his brain is very hot. Uh, yes, but we want him to channel his strength to something more beneficial. Creating a state in the southeast, naming it Ikemba State, headquartering it in Newe or Newe North local government is not the problem. The problem is this. Nigeria is a failed state. No matter the state you created, if you like have 10 states as a southeast zone, development will not come. They will only give you the mega resources they call allocation, monthly allocation. If there's no confederation, nothing works. Nigeria is not practicing true federalism or federal states, so there's nothing you are saying that will work in this contraption. After all, even if you demand for another state, others will demand again. In Benue State, they're demanding. Yes, they're demanding for states. In virtually all the states in Nigeria are looking for more states. So what are we not talking about? Okay? Yes. So we are talking about referendum. Freedom. That is what we are saying. And so we believe that our people are supposed to be thinking in this direction. If this lawmaker can challenge his strength to ask in Tinibu to release Mazinam Lekano and call for a referendum, I think he will be making more sense than asking for more states. In Confab of 2014, organized by President Gulo Jonathan, it was, you know, stated that another state would be created for the Southeast. The argument was made and it was accepted. Whilst other regions were demanding for more state too. So, what happened to that confab? Buhari came and dumped it. Even Jonathan couldn't implement it. And he was booted out of office by that challenge they conducted. So, and now, the lawmaker is asking for another state. So, this argument of another state for the Southeast will not do anything good for the Southeast. What we are talking about is now is a referendum. Young man, we appreciate your vigor, your vibes, and your strength. Please, channel it to more something beneficial. Talk about the release of Mazinam Lekano. Talk about referendum. Talk about freedom of your people from the contraption. That's what we have been saying. Join in the struggle to liberate our people from the contraption. Not by creating additional states that you will liberate our people from the contraption. You do it you know, by seeking something that will be beneficial to the future generations, unborn children. That is what we are saying. So all energies, all strength, channels to referendum, channel to freedom of our people. Channel from liberation from the contraption. That is the point we are making. We appreciate the young man, but we want him to channel his energy in the right direction 